A short note. Invoking emotion removes logic. Originally published at libertyunderattack.com on August 2nd, 2015, and read to you by Shane Radliff, the author. Here at Liberty Under Attack, we talk, about a, we talk and write about a lot of subjects that have the potential to piss a lot of people off. We certainly don't do it because we enjoy people being pissed at us. When we discuss certain professions or subjects, it seems to invoke emotion and seems to also completely, completely remove logic and rationality from the equation. I certainly understand why some of these folks feel the way they do, but political correctness and the suppression of the true meaning of freedom has infected minds and has certainly contributed to the mess that we currently see ourselves in. Yes, we acknowledge this, and no, we aren't going to stop doing what we are doing because someone's feelings might have been hurt. In the real world, there are consequences for our actions, or our inaction. In this world we are living in, the danger is the violent monopoly known as the state, and the consequences humanity has faced and is facing is democide, murder by government. If I had to prioritize someone's feelings over the mass murder of innocent civilians by the state, I and any moral human being would choose the latter. Now you know why, why we won't stray away from any subject. We approach every single topic with morality, logic, and consistent philosophical principles, and it just so happens that some of our listeners aren't morally or philo philosophically sound. That's what we have come to expect, and don't think that will change any time soon. If you're one of those folks that has emotional reactions to the things we discuss, I would first recommend you continue listening to Liberty Under Attack Radio and do so with an open mind. Secondly, I would recommend examining yourself, your moral values, and start learning philosophy. The first step is to become free within your own mind, and I tend to think that most people are mentally and physically enslaved. It's time for that to change. A short note. Invoking emotion removes logic. Originally published at libertyunderattack.com on August 2nd, 2015, and read to you by Shane Radliff, the author.